as you create your game with RPG Builder, you're most likely going to want to create your custom armor types or things that your character can equip. The demo of RPG Builder comes with a lot of things such as shoulders, pants, gloves, and so on. In this video, I'm going to show you, for example, how to create something called a rune. It could be any name, it could be anything, but in this video, we're going to create a new rune type of items that we can equip with our character. The first step is to go under types, armor types, and here, as you can see, uh, we have cloth, leather, and plate, and none of those really fits to something like a rune. So I'm going to create a new um, armor type called artifacts. Again, this could be any name, of course. I'm just making this for the um, purpose of this video. And here you see that we have the armor slots, belt, boot, gloves, and so on. And I'm just going to call this one rune. As always, this name can be anything you want. And I'm going to go ahead and save. Now, if we go under economy and items and create a new one, you can see that now we can have or custom uh, armor type that we just created called artifacts as well as the slot which is a rune so that's really cool and i'm going to uh, select the rarity also and let's make it legendary so it's going to look cool i'm going to select an icon and call it for example fire rune we can add it some stats uh, we can for example add a chance to burn so when we hit with our abilities we can have for example a 20 percent chance to burn and we could have some um, fire penetration so let's say 15 percent and i'm not going to add any visual to this rune but you could if you follow the armor video that i released a few days ago you could absolutely have something visible on your character when you equip this uh, rune which is pretty cool and that's really all we have to do um, for the database part at least now this rune is in your database it has its own types extra and it's ready to be equipped but we have one more step to do because right now in our character panel this rune slot is not going to appear right so we have to um, define it somewhere so let's open the game ui for this we go under essentials and i'm going to double click the rpg builder essentials here now we have the uh, game ui prefab and i'm going to go under character and here you can see that we have the current armor slots so we have our weapons a belt and so on and here i'm going to select boots and duplicate them I'm going to call this rune. The name doesn't matter, but uh, it's just good to keep things uh, clean and easier to find later. And the really only thing you need to do here is under armor slot, select the rune or whatever you just created and save it. That's it. We go back, we save the prefab, we go outside of the main prefab and we can now go in game. And you can now go to an existing character or a new one. I don't have a character created at the moment, so I'm going to make a new one. Maybe make the mage that just came out in the 2.0.3 demo. And as you can see now, I have my new uh, slot. Of course, I didn't change the icon. I probably should have. It would have looked better in the video. But yeah, as of now, we're still showing the boot icon. But as you can see, I can't equip boots here. But if I go ahead and give myself the fire rune. So as you can see, uh, let me go in maximize as you can see here we have our fire rune that we just created and if i equip it it is going in its slots just as it should and you can repeat this process as many times as you want for all your custom um, armor slots but like i said it's not really just for armors right we just created a rune so you could have a backpack or anything um in this thing and in this category and you can of course show them on your character uh, without any issue just like um in the armor video just like those things, for example, will show on your character and hide when you unequip them. You could have the same thing for a rune extra. So that's it. I hope you liked the video. I hope you find it easier than in 1.1 if you use 1.1 before. Let me know if you have any questions in the Discord and see you in the next video.